What's going on everybody? This is Dave from Steel City Jones Flight Academy. Today we're here to talk about the Colorado PRCS Elite Battery Charging Station for Mavic 2. So we really like this. We've been using this for most of this year and on our training missions that we have for our Mavics and we really like it. What we have here is the ability to do four batteries simultaneously at one time charging. And what we like about it the most is we can get the batteries up from 20% to 90% charged in only 30 minutes. So really allows us to be able to have only three or four batteries needed only if we're gonna be running all day long to be enough for what we need. Now, if we wanna charge them all the way up to 100%, we're looking about 55 minutes. But again, that's 55 minutes to charge four of these batteries at the same time. Now, a popular option when someone buys a Mavic 2 Enterprise is to also get the Flymore kit. Now, the Flymore kit comes with two Enterprise batteries. It comes with a quad charger that can charge one battery at a time and a shoulder bag. Now, again, because we have, when the Mavic Enterprise comes with a nice case, we're really not gonna need that shoulder bag. And props, you know, really, not too many people go through props and it also comes with one extra set of props with the aircraft. So I don't necessarily think that we actually even have to get extra props. So what is that really giving us? It's giving us a single charger, really, and two extra batteries. What I think the better way to go would be, when you're buying an Enterprise, is to go ahead and get a charger like this and just get two to three extra batteries. If you have a total of four Mavic batteries, you can run those all day long. When we have a total of four batteries, that's gonna give us 80 minutes of flight time with this, uh, the assumption that we're gonna get 20 minutes of flight time out of a battery. Now, a lot of people say, well, I can get a lot more than 20 minutes out of a battery. Well, look at our video that we just made about why the Mavic 2 batteries fail, and you'll understand why, realistically, we're gonna get anywhere from 16 to 20 minutes of flight time. So with that said, when this allows us to be able to get from 20% all the way back up to 90% and only 30 minutes, this is a game changer when we wanna go ahead and run all day long. And this also has a provision with two USBs to allow us to be able to charge our smart controller at the same time. So if we're gonna necessarily just stay right by our charging station, we can keep that smart controller topped off with the power all day long and we can fly endlessly as much as we need to. So that really is nice. This also has a charger for a Crystal Sky. So if you have a Crystal Sky charger as well, you wanna charge those batteries, this can do that as well. This has a really heavy duty power supply in it. It has multiple fan, cooling fans inside here to be able to allow this to be able to stay cool. The charging station also can accept pure sine wave, or traditional sine wave from an older type of generator. So you don't have to worry about your generator actually blowing up your charging station. It's also smart not to regulate temperature and how much current it's gonna be putting out depending upon how hot it is or humid it is in the environment as well or how hot the batteries are. It's really nice because it will not charge the batteries right away. When you take them off, it's gonna to have to give it about five minutes or so to cool down. So that is nice, it's, it's a really an intelligent algorithm to be able to charge. So we really like this charging station. We've been using this all year for our on-site training missions and we could not be happier with this. So if you'd like to get a quote or more information on this type of system, please let us know. While on the subject of battery charging, if you want to know more about why the Mavic 2 batteries fail, please check out the video that we just put out together on why Mavic 2 batteries fail. If you have any more questions, please let us know. Stay safe out there. We'll talk to you soon. Thanks again.